back guys. Today's test drive is a 1968 Chevelle. Got a Daco Correct 396 under the hood. And a little bit of a lifter noise. Sounds like it's coming from the right side here, right off the top. Got power steering, candy apple paint, electric fans, disc brakes, drum on the rear, American racing wheels with decent tires. Pretty good shape. I just did a walk around pointing out any kind of flaws on the body so you know everything about this car. Be sure to check that out. I'll link the videos up at the last 30 seconds of this video so you can easily access them. And I do post videos pretty much daily. So hit that subscribe button. Check out maplemotors.com. That is my main website. Here on YouTube, you get to see the test drive videos and the walk arounds. Maplemotors.com offers 100 detailed pictures, shipping information, wheels, tires, parts, accessories, and finance options. For now, we're gonna be taking this thing down the road. Hit that like button. It's about that time. Let's go for a ride. I like to check the car out before we take off. Just look around the interior. Pretty clean, mechanics headliner. Somebody got it up there and didn't stretch it, but looks fairly new. Dash pad's in good shape. Got the candy apple on the dash here and on the glove box. A uh, little leakage on the floor. A little moist down there. I think the front and the rear window need the seals replaced to keep the water out. This start up pretty easy. I got a clown painted on here. There's the mileage. Engine temperature's up. She's ready to go. And I do have the radio in the office. Lower motor I couldn't get it to cut on. And I need a little switch for the wipers to even check them. I'll try this horn out, y'all ready? There's no spring in it. But I bet it wants to honk. Let's take off down the road. Okay, so we're getting ready to take off here. Anything I see, I will let you know. Uh, I didn't notice it's missing the other half of the seatbelt. It's got one side. They must have been replacing the seats and uh, forgot to put it back in. Like I said, I do these test drives so you know exactly what these cars need. This thing's idled down pretty low. Both sides of the dash. Missing a rear view mirror. 
Okay, so I idled her up just a hair. Just pulled that air cleaner and you could actually twist it if you got a good grip and give it a little bit of a turn. Idle her up enough to where I don't have to two foot it anymore. We're gonna put about $20 worth of fuel in this car, make sure she wasn't gonna run out of gas on us. We'll get that ticket and check that gauge and get her started back up. We're also gonna go on to the scene where I drive around the parking lot, get some outside shots. And uh, I'll light the undercarriage up so you can see that as well. All right, let's check this out. Look in here and you can't hardly see it, but yes, that gas gauge is coming up. This, this lens here is not very clean. It's just faded from age, but our gas tank is about half full now. So gas gauge works. to the car lot now got some outside shots of this car and we're ready to go here Trying 
to decide if I just want to cut through there. I think I might be sitting here for four or five minutes. this video if you have any questions go ahead and jump on over to maplemotors.com it should answer most of them thanks for watching hope y'all enjoyed this video you can check out maplemotors.com for financing shipping options under detailed pictures wheels tires parts and accessories because maplemotors.com is our main website a lot of people get confused about that youtube here is a, a source to let you know what the cars need we provide that for people out of state to make a purchase easier. Okay, guys, I do appreciate y'all watching. I want to thank you again. Hit that like button. Also, share helps us out greatly. And if you subscribe, hit that notification bell. It'll let you know every time I post a new car. I appreciate you watching. Thanks again, guys.